here, and today we've got a new addition to the Reptile Journey family, and that is a green anole. Don't get too close. <laughs> but we're going to do a tank setup for you guys. Right now, I have already put in the Eagle Earth for the tank, which is a loose coconut substrate to it. It's like a grounded up coconut, basically. And which is super great to hold in moisture, which the green and all really needs a lot of moisture in there. And right now we're about to start setting up the actual decorations. So here I just have a little log I'm going to put over in here, just like right here. Let me cover it up a bit so it doesn't move that much. What I have about like maybe a half an inch of substrate so they could be good enough to hold it in. I think good right there should be good enough. You think uh you like that right spot? You think it's good enough spot? Um we have a water dish or food, um whatever I would prefer to do. I'm gonna do water for this thing. And we have this plant from the yeah, Exoterra but it doesn't matter where you get it, this is a nice plant. Let's take off this, see if I can... I hate those things, it hurt my fingers. Yeah. Alright, about that. So, we have here just a nice, like a vine-ish almost. I'm gonna put it right all across here, right above, right on here, so you guys think, it, you guys like this? Audience around me. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Woo -woo -woo party! <laughs> now basically, party I have the tank set up, but what I'm gonna do right now, I'll be back. If you wanna follow me? Go ahead. <laughs> I'm just gonna This, which I'm going to use to spray uh, his tank down real quick. And just so you guys say hello to Artemis. Alright, let's go on. Oh, wait. So, we all know. Yeah, I've seen my room a bit before. But our new friend is going right here. We already have his little light structure here. Which came with the tank. For me, I think it is suitable for it. Mm. So let's continue on. We're back. All right. So I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna spray down the inside. Moisture enough, I think, and then I'm gonna fill up this water bowl. All right. Now this is what the tank should look like. I'm gonna, uh, 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 uh. When you're done setting up, so you know this is a 3.3 gallon tank, which is decent enough for one and all. And right here, if I can get this lid back on. Mm -hmm. yeah. Alright, we have the lid on. And right here, we open it up. We're going to take the lovely green and all. We're still working on the name. And we're going to put the t this little thing in here. We're going to crack it open <laughs> open it up he's gonna, he's gonna run out I'm gonna close it in case he goes a little crazy All right. and is he I know he's not out come on buddy out he's out he's right there guys I'm gonna grab 
with the container. And here we are. Here is his enclosure. Come in closer and you can see him nice and well. Come in. Uh, I'm going to spray it a bit more because it looks kind of dry again. Right, there you go, people. That's how you set up a green and old tank. This is a decent size. Let him discover what he has in there. That's all we have for today. And we're still working on the name. If you want to leave a suggestion down in the comments below, go ahead. And that is it. Never say no to Tommy. Here we are.